there, I'm Clifford Bates, and welcome once again to reading Aristotle's Nicomathiatics. And today we're looking at chapter four of book four, which uh, on well, this is a weird thing. It's on it's on, um, in fact, this will be a short chapter. This is a short, much shorter chapter. The previous chapter on mag uh, on magnanimity or greatness of soul, greatness of soul, was a huge chapter. It was it was it, it took us a long time to go through it. It was one of the longest in this book. And now this is not the shortest chapter of this book per se, but it's going to be much, much more shorter than that. But what's so interesting, is its focus is on ambition, right? Ambition uh, as, uh, uh, as a thing, uh, 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 about ambition. Now, uh, and it's tied with honor, on uh, uh, as much as honor. Now, what's interesting is in this book four, in book four of the politics, we deal with the virtues. Um, it, it, it doesn't deal with courage. It, 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 it deals with the higher virtues, we say, the higher virtues, whereas not the, 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 virtues, the virtues that deal with pleasure and pain were finished up in the last part of book three. Uh, 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 these virtues are, seem to be external things in that sense, tied with honor and other things. Uh, the first virtue was goods, with goods, goods, krimita. And then in the, uh, uh, chapter one was dealing with liberality, the, the, the more common thing, and then the one that dealt with the greater thing was dealt next. Now, regarding with honor, in the, the, the last, the previous chapter, we, 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 instead of doing this, instead of doing the lower than high, greater, we got, we started with the greater, right? The magn the great soul, the great, the high, uh, things that are honor. Things, and now we're, this one is going to go with the lesser, the lower. So it takes the opposite. In other words, we had a path. We had a with liberality. We went from liberality to mag magnificence, right? Then we went from mag uh, 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 me sukia, meg greatness of soul, to uh, 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 what we ambition in this sense, right? He goes. Uh, so let's go to it, right? Quick. Um, but there seems to be a certain virtue also concerned with honor, just as it was said in the first discussion. That is, uh, of course, in two seven. Uh, 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 this is at you know the famous thing at book two, chapter seven, where he lists it. Um, at at eleven oh seven b twenty four through thirty one, right? he says. He goes, after talking about the honors and dishonors, he goes that just as we say what sobriety bears relation to magnificence, though it might be, cons this is this is chapter two, just as it uh, uh, bears liberality to magnificence, though it differs by being concerned with small things, there is also another uh, 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 virtue that bears in relation to greatness of soul, right? Uh, the latter concerns with great honor, the former with small honors, right? For it is a possession to long honors as one ought, and more or less as one ought, that the person who is excessive in his longing in this regard is to be ambitious, uh, the uh, 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 deficient, uh, 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 unambitious, while the one in the middle is nameless, right? This is a nameless virtue in this point. Whereas the question of it, uh, um, um, and the disposition, in fact, nameless as an, an except at the ambition of the ambitious person, right? Uh, this is why people in the extremes lay claim to the middle ground. But we sometimes call the middle person ambitious, sometimes unambitious, right? But it's nameless. And sometimes we praise the ambitious person, sometimes the unambitious one. Uh, for what causes, uh, for what is cause is on account of what we, uh, 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 which we do this, we will uh, uh, subsequent. Uh, we will state subsequently. Thus far, let us speak of what remains in the matter and has a guide for us. So, therefore, what's interesting is, um, uh, uh, you know, concerning honor and dishonor. He, this is like starting at twenty two, eleven o seven b twenty two. That whole pa uh, that, that paragraph. That goes to 1108A3 um, uh, in uh, 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 ch uh, 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 Chapter 7 of Book 2. So go back, look at what we covered several weeks ago, 
couple of chapters back in book two, chapter seven. I should have a link to it. I'm not that good as a computer. I'm not that brilliant of a computer person. Because this kind of is the background. And the original account is very interesting. The original account talks about honor and dishonor. And this gives a very almost non-existent account of great soldiers. Right? It, just, it says, okay, and that the difference is the ability of great soldiers. And the last chapter, we saw how fast account. He, 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 uh, whereas in the original account in 2.7, great soldiers gets just mentioned and the function is more about ambition and honor and the, the namelessness of the virtue. It's a nameless virtue. Okay. This virtue is a nameless virtue. Um, the one, it's excessive one is, we say, is the one in excess is the ambitious and the one in excess is the unambitious, right? You, you, you want more honor than its merit, right? So therefore, this is how that we, therefore, that's why we, uh, just as was said in the first discussion, which would seem to stand in a similar way to greatness of soul as liberality stands to magnificence, right? It would seem that way. But then, no, it doesn't. Because what happens with magnet, what, what's so shocking about what happened in mag, uh, uh, magnanimity is that it is a crown. It is it, it is then said to be the crown. It, it embraces all the virtue. And in fact, some people argue of the accounts of the, the so-called. Um, there's that they say that there's possibly two peaks of virtue. Me, two peaks of virtue. The peak of I mean, remember we have. Um, 11 virtues, right? We have the 11 virtues, uh, the virtues of uh, 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 liberality, magnificence, greatness of soul, the unnamed or ambition, uh, proper, you know, ambition, uh, 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 Lord, you know, uh, Lord, uh, uh, Connors, they, they mentioned their list on the, on the page just before the translation, uh, uh, ambition, but that's, it's, 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 it's called ambition, but has, it's nameless, uh, gent gentleness, uh, Friendliness, uh, truthfulness, wittiness. Uh, okay, right. Of the uh, 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 one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Libera. And I forgot um, uh, moderation or sophosune. And uh, so it's it's uh, uh, um, courage, moderation, sophosune, liberality, magnificence, megalosokia, greatness of soul. Um, uh, ambition, uh, uh, gentleness, uh, 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 friendliness, truthfulness, missing one, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten, uh, 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 ten, uh, uh, ten virtues. Ten, ten. Is it ten? No, no. All right. So liberality, magnificence. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, it's eight. Eight plus two is ten. So that's why it's eleven. Okay, shame is the last one. Um, so we have ten, and therefore the uh, uh, the fifth would be the middle, right? The greatness of soul is the fifth. Uh, it's the middle, in that sense. It's the middle. It's the long. It's the longest. Or the longest in the middle. Well, if you take the courage and courage together, if you had all the different, you had you had f four chapters on courage and three on moderation, but then everything here is one. Uh, liberality was bigger than magnificence, but then greatness of soul was uh, 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 larger than even liberality, right? Um, uh, and, and this is an ambition. The general thing, uh, the general thing, or, or the things that deal with the small one, right? We would think the general thing here is this: uh, liberality is, is a kind of giving and taking, right? A giving and taking. Here is the getting, uh, the getting of honors, or seeking of honors, or being honored, right? How does uh, how does one honor? How does uh, now, this is the problem about this. Now, it seems both are removed. In other words, he says that, uh, continuing here, seem to stand in the way to, to greatness of soul as liberality stands in magnificence. Both are a remove from what is great, but dispose us to 
such as we ought to be when it comes to measure uh, to measured in small things. It's in other words, it's it's removed from what is great, but is this dispose us to what we ought to be when it comes to uh, uh, to to measured in small things. Now, this is in other words, the as, as liberality deals with the measured and small uh, uh, things that are ours and small things, and the magna magnificence deals with the great things, and magnanimity deals or, or greatness of soul deals with the great actions, right? Here it does with the measured and small actions. How are we? Just as there is a mean and an excess when it, the deficiency of taking and giving of money, so also the longing for honor one can have more or less of such a longing other than uh, one ought on account um, okay. um, other words uh, 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 so also longing for honor one can have more or less such as the longing than one ought and can and one can seek honor from where and in what way one ought to so there's this is the question what what when is the how, what what should you in other words the longing for honor one can can have for more or less uh, 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 of uh, of such a longing than one ought okay and the one uh, and one can seek honor from where and and in the way one ought. So it's an it's an honor seeking of the not of the greatest things, but generally in a sense, right? The general sense in that sense. The 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 the, 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 the what do you call it? from the uh, uh, measure come to measured and small things, moderate and small things. For we blame the ambitious person. Now this is 28. The word ambitious is a philotimos, a literary love of honor, right? Love, the philotimos, the ambitious is the lover of honor. The philotimos, lover of honor. While the one who is lacks ambition is a philotimos, without the lover. So it's love of honor. The text here is Greek, the lover of honor. We blame the lover of honor on the ground that he is getting he aims at getting honor more than he ought, and from where he ought not. And we blame the, the, the one without the, the non-lover of honor, the unambitious person, on the grounds that he chooses not to be honored even in the case of what is beautiful, noble, kolos. But sometimes we praise the, uh, uh, the lover of honor, the ambitious person, as manly and a lover of what is beautiful. So therefore, the, the ambitious, the lover of honor, the, the, uh, of the Greek here is the philotimos, philotimos. The philotimos, um, the lover of honor, the, which he's, he's translating as the ambitious, uh, is, yes, the, at an extreme, the lover of honor is an extreme, uh, is an excess, because particularly when he's not doing it right, but when but but then the opposite of the one who doesn't right, um, this is what. But then we can and sometimes we speak of the love. Uh, in other words, sometimes we praise this lover of honor as manly and as a lover of what is beautiful. And we praise uh, and we praise the unambitious person, <laughs> the the what do you call the, um, the without the love of honor, the one without the love of honor. We praise the one who is without love of honor, right? Uh, 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 as a measured and moderate sophosunos, sophosunos, just as we said in the first discussion, again, two, book two, chapter seven, as well. Uh, so therefore, this is the problem. It's the, the, this middle place is both, we have a situation that it's love of those who love honor and those who don't have love of honor. The question is, when is it fitting? When is it correct to to want honor and not seek honor? Now, this is for this again. This concerns honor, not of the great things, 
which we don't really get the question of not seeking honor for. You don't, you don't, in other words, the Meglosokia does not, the Meglosokia does not seek honor for things that are not worthy of it. So there's not this need, therefore, there is also the implied not seeking of honor. Uh, he only seeks, he seeks honor for only the highest things. And he only seeks to be honored by those worthy of giving it. Okay. This is not the case here. That you, that therefore, this, this, this loving of honor, the philosimos and the a philosimos, is this uh, 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 the seeking of honor and the uh, not seeking of honor. Uh, is this, and therefore, we praise and blame both situations. When it's appropriate to seek honor, we praise it. When it's, uh, 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 we, when it's inappropriate to seek honor and therefore they, you don't seek it, uh, you, we raise you as being moderate and, and, and measured, right? Yet it's clear since we speak of the lover uh, of such and such in various ways, we do not simply uh, uh, apply the phrase lover of honor uh, 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 to the same thing, the philotimos, to the same thing, a lover of this and lover of that. When we are offering praise, we apply the term to those who love, or, uh, love honor more than the many do. Okay, We, we, we pr praise them. In, that. They, in other words, we love honor more than the many do, they, in that sense. But when we uh, are speaking in terms of blame, to those who love honor more than they ought. So they were the, the lover of honor is the one who loves it in a certain, the proper way, is the one who loves it more than the vulgar do. They seek what is honorable. They love that love here is the philos to be just to, to, it's not an eros, it's not the word eros, it's philos friend, it's to be inclined towards to be inclined towards, the, the, to, to seek, to seek in the sense, to seek the honorable, right? Seek what is honorable. Therefore, if it's truly honorable, this is, in other words, the, uh, they seek what is truly honorable, not what the vulgar honor, okay? So therefore, we praise the one who seeks that, and then we blame the one who what? We we uh, uh, blame uh, 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 the one uh, who, uh, 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 but we're, when we're speaking in terms of blame, we blame those who love honor more than they ought. Not, uh, they, they seek the honor of the things that they ought not to seek honor from. And then they do, they seek honor in ways that are not fitting. Okay. When, uh, uh, since the mean is nameless, the extreme seem to, the extreme seem to dispute over it as it were unclaimed. That's very interesting. That the the mean is a nameless mean, and it seeks to fight the extremes, uh, to lo loving honor and not loving honor, are what it, it, it is the they're claiming this middle ground. They both claim this middle ground because of the circumstance, um, which is very interesting. This is completely at odds with Meglosokia, right? Um, uh, the fermentation of here. Um, uh, or unclaimed. It seems the dispute over it as of unclaimed, but when the excess and deficiency, there exists also a middle term. And uh, where there exists the excess, and there, is, uh, there must exist, when there exists a deficiency and ex excess and deficiency, there exists also a middle term. And, and people long both for honor more than they are and less. And therefore it's possible to do so in a, as one ought. It is characteristic that this is praised. Then th uh, though the mean with respect to honor is nameless. In relation to ambition, it appears as a lack of ambition, right? In, in, in relation to ambition, it appears at one level a lack of ambition. In relation to a lack of ambition, it appears ambition. And in relation to both, it is somehow appears as both. This seems to be the case also with the other virtues. But here it is the extremes that appear to be opposite of each other because the middle term has not been named. 
So this is the, this is, in other words, here, the virtue that is the common virtue, this is the kind of lower virtue from Magna Sophia, of honor, that concerned with honor, the appropriate, the, there's not a name for that, uh, 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 for how to receive, in other words, the receiving of what is great and knowing your greatness. Magna Sophia is, it concerns itself with honor, but it's not, and it's really odd because even the Megiddo Sakia doesn't, the, he doesn't, you know, he doesn't pursue honor for uh, honor's sake. He, pers he pursues what is great, okay? He does what is great. And he likes, you know, he, he only wants the honor from those who are serious, right? So therefore, we have a very odd discussion here. This is a weird, this is a, um, the chapter 4-4, four, 4-4 four, four, four is a very weird thing. Because it first of all it breaks the logic of how four so far is back. The, 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 the more general, uh, the, the, the more general common thing than the higher thing, right? From the make liberality to magnificence, to the mega, the thing of get, 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 giving and getting, and then what? Uh, then the question of honor. Seeking of honor, we start with the greatest of honors. We start with the high, and now we then go to the, the, the middling and the low. Uh, we address the middling and the low. Remember, the Megalosuki is not going to concern with middling honors or even uh, things of petty, small things. In other words, the, the small honors and the small uh, importance things. So, therefore, but they, they're important also. They have to be dealt with, and people need to do it. So, this is therefore more common. This is the more ordinary. But therefore, the virtue of the more ordinary honoring is a very problematic. It's, it's those who want too much. It's either you want it, you either want too much or too little. And the mean is a little bit that from for the people who seek honor, this is like, well, you don't honor it enough. Uh, 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 you don't want it. You know, you, you, those who are doing it rightly, the mean is it looks deficient from the point of view of the honor lover, the ones who really love honor. And if from the point of view of the those who don't love honor, it, it looks like an extreme. In other words, it's, it, in other words, uh, from this point it looks deficient, and from this point it looks excessive, right? From the the the, uh, the one who lacks the, the, the non lover of honor looks at the, the moderate person as though you you know, excess, right? So therefore, the, these things are in relation to each other, and this is, a, and this is again, this is. A, Again, middle. It reminds us of the problem of pleasure. The un, you know, the in other words, the pleasure seeking, and the fear thing. The fear relationship to fear. That uh, um, the coward is worse than the the coward is worse than the that. But then the coward is less bad than the. Uh, uh, um, um, the coward is less bad than the the, the, the person who just gratifies their pleasures, right? The, the, uh, 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 the thing. So we have this weird ending of this chapter here. Okay, this is, this is I stop here. We put your questions and concerns there below, and uh, I'll get to them when I see them. Um, if you have any more comments, please put them below, and I will respond to them. Um, if, if you have any, you think I should, you know, you want some, you don't understand this, you want some more things you ask about questions I'll greatly again I said respond to them when I see them uh, if you look please like it hit the like button help it'll help the algorithm uh, please share we share the video get people's attention to it bring their attention to what's going on uh, if not you can always uh, uh, okay uh, subscribe I always I jump ahead subscribe um, uh, if you have not subscribed already please subscribe encourage your friends to get your, bring friends and notify people you know that might be interested in the topics we're doing with about the channel and help hope that they encourage to subscribe because like growing the channel helps and we want to get that you know we have to go a lot more before we get that you know some mechanisms that we got a tip jar or something like that so we can you know people can like uh help us um next thing we have to do is we have to uh, if you didn't like it you can something wrong you didn't like something here please put the your next comment on it so that we can all benefit from it. Uh, if you don't like it, say what. If you guys say no, you can hit like this like button, but say why so we can learn. Uh, not in other words, not only I, uh, you know, I can take the criticism, but maybe people can say, oh, yeah, he's very right. You, you know, uh, therefore, 
this is your way of helping others benefit from what you think I did wrong um, or I'm, I'm wrong about. Uh, another thing is um, if you want to see my social media links, please see the links below. Um, uh, uh, um, another thing you can do is um, uh, if you want to follow me, you can follow me on the social media links. Another thing you can do is what you can follow me on academic social media links. Uh, if you want to know about me more, more about me as a scholar and as a researcher, you can check those links below the social media, academic social media. You can see my research and scholarship as well through it. Uh, um, then um, another thing you can do is you want to help me to do what I do, uh, do so. You can do so. Uh, well, you can always go to my social media, my academic social media, find my e university email and send me a Google gift card or uh, 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 Amazon, uh, Barnes and Noble gift card, or something like that. I appreciate it'd be one. It, it's it's nice to do that because it'll help. But I understand. Okay, I'm begging. I'm begging, man. Oh, please, oh, please, begging. Yeah, okay, whatever. Um, another thing you can do is um, you, know, through, you can if you want to do so regularly in an efficient manner, which is small little amounts. Um, you can do those to subscribe to our Patreon. The links are below. Or you can buy one of my books. That if you're not bought a book already and you want to be interested in, in what I do, you know someone who, or you know someone who might be interested in Aristotle and, and Aristotle's politics, you can get one of my books that are listed below. If you're uh, someone who's interested in their politics, um, in Aristotle's politics, studying it as a thing, the the Lulu book, the notebook for Aristotle's politics, would be a very useful tool. Um, and if you do order it, uh, okay, you can order it any way you want to. Like you say, you can order the books by Amazon, your local bookstore, Amazon, uh, uh, any online bookseller. Um, but if you're going to order the notebook for politics, you want to really help me, and you want to make sure that I get the money the bookstore gets, then buy it from Lulu. Okay? Well, that's it. Um, uh, uh, and next time we see we see each other, we'll look at next chapter, chapter five. We'll take care and have a good day. Bye bye.